So let's do the housekeeping. I'm smoking my Peterson system pipe, which was handed down to me via my mother from my grandfather. And in it I am smoking a black stag from Mark and Amber. Now while everyone's showing their cobs, I thought I might as well show mine. It's show and hell tell show and hell. Show and tell time. First cob is a legend. And I have replaced the standard stem with the Brain H1 stem. That Dan made for me. The next cob is a Colonel that Scott kindly sent to me. Thanks again, Scott. And again, here I have put a stem that Brainwich One made for me that I had modified so it's a bit wobbly here because I've actually reheated it and bent it for a different pipe but I don't use that pipe anymore so I transfer the stem back onto this one, the Colonel and then I have the General and in the General or on the General I should say I have a Metamorphous Sarge stem that I won in one of his little contests so that's very and nice. then I have my freehand that was a trade swap with Night Door, Bob. And I've replaced the standard stem. It came with, with uh, a stem and from a pipe I purchased from Israel, which I didn't really like, but I love this stem. So there you have the main cobs I use. I have others, but I tend they tend to be the same so they're either legend or generals and now I can add this one to them as well it's beautiful I do have two other cobs that I'd like to show you these cobs are Missouri Merchant they have the labels on the bottom and they don't actually make them anymore this is a legend church warden. The stem has a metal piece on the end there and it has a gold coloured ring around the shank. I don't smoke that one, I keep it in mint condition. I've been told is a general. It's not a MacArthur. It's an old general. Again they don't make this one anymore. This one has a metal piece on the stem. It takes this is a special carbon filter. It's unused. It could also take the paper filters but that is a carbon filter. Again it has the gold band, it also has an overlaid MM with the Missouri Merchant stamp sticker on the bottom. But it is much bigger than the modern day general that they make. These are the pipes in order of size. This is a uh, old, much older general. This is from the 1930s. The other thing you notice is that the corn here is much thicker. The walls here are much thicker than the modern ones. The modern ones are thinner. And now I've got uh, a new one for the collection, so thank you very much, Scott, and indeed Ricardo.
I look forward to using that. Thanks for watching everyone. Take care. Keep them alight. I'll see you next time. Bye.